sometimes a Jeff. I mostly do some theory crafting stuff. Uh, sometimes I say dumb shit too. Uh, I try not to do two, do both at the same time. Try to not say dumb shit when I'm theory crafting, but hey, mistakes happen. Evolve to the end. We send the call. Heaven works on borrowed time. Empty pages burn forever mine. Masquerade us up on high. All we are is all we've left behind. <laughs> Thank you, Ningong. Actually kind of impressive. Like, that is actually kind of impressive. Where getting more than 100 crit rate doesn't help you. For her passive specifically, getting more than 1,000 EM doesn't help you. So all that's left is the rest. And above 1,000 EM isn't that good for the rest. So generally, what you're going to want to be doing is you're going to want to aim for... the best artifacts you have, right? So, depending on which artifacts that you, you're you using and which team you're using, like, if you're using on-field Nahida with a, a, a Gilded Dream set, right? You're getting 250 EM from her passive, and you're getting um, 230 EM from this. That's 480. You're getting another 115 from her Ascension, so she's already basically at 600 with no, without anything, without any stats. You give her a main stat, she's already at almost 800. You give her a few sub stats, she's up around 900. With just an EM sense. And then if you get an EM goblet or circlet, you're going above 1,000, and it would be better to go a dendro goblet or a crit circlet. That means you think this is good? What do you think about this? How about Shanling? My Shanling build is like... Good? But she's probably my my worst build out of the ones I have. Th this piece is kind of nuts. <laughs> which is why it's an off piece. Uh, this one's good for an on piece goblet, but it's not, like, insane. Uh, this one is fucking insane. Like, holy shit. This one's also pretty fucking good. And this one's also pretty fucking good. It's just one thing. <laughs> How many accounts do I have? I mean, I have one account. There's four regions on each account. I play on my America account. I also play on the Taiwan account. And I don't really play on the other two. Although the EU account is like AR50. Asia account is AR10. I haven't played much on the Taiwan account for a while though. Uh, the, the, the fact that, that like in Nilo teams you can't hyperbloom, that is completely fine. The, the restriction I speak of is... Well, the one that makes her passive just stop working if you have a non hydro dendro unit on your team. That is the restriction that bothers me. The other one is good. Like, the other one, it's not actually a restriction. It's, 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 it's her passive. It's what it does.